Just sit here for a moment. Oh, again with the tank and wires? Well, yes, but don't worry. You won't be sitting and answering questions for four hours. Take your wrap off. So, what have you been up to? Oh, you know, the normal genius. <laughs> I was trying to figure out some of these codes on my computer, but uh, Sheldon is uh, having a problem with figuring out, so I have to deal with that, and that's been fantastic. He says without a hint of sarcasm. <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. Any new recipes you're trying? No. Um, I haven't really been in the kitchen that often. Lab, now. Hmm? Sensei? What's up, Rapunzel? Uh, did you sleep well? You a cop? Raf sent you? No, I'm just asking. Okay. No, I didn't really sleep last night. Why? Eh, just one of the worst days. I know that look. What's going on? How? I was raised by the future you. I know when something's up. I technically have known you for longer than you've been alive. Uh, I keep forgetting how messed up this whole thing is. But no, everything's fine. Michelangelo isn't getting out of it, is he? I have no idea what you're talking about. He's glowing. Yeah, we do that from time to time. Leo, it's been a week. He should have stopped by now. In my timeline, he glow after using his powers too. But only for like two days, max. But he'd always go back to normal. Right? Well... I... he... <sighs> Do you remember when I told you that none of you survived in my timeline? Casey... Opening the portal that allowed me to travel in time... Cost my master Michelangelo his life. And you didn't tell me?! I didn't think it'd be important information! You... didn't... think... My... brother... is... Dying! Everything's important! Then why didn't you tell me about the situation? Update me next time! <sighs> what? Are you angry at me? No. I'm not angry at you. I'm angry at myself! I caused all of this! I keep putting myself in danger like a total idiot, and he keeps hurting himself to save me! And now, he only has a few months left to live! It was his choice to save you! You're not responsible for others' choices! But I am! I am their leader! I am responsible for keeping them safe! You are a team. Everyone here looks out for each other and does what's in their power to save as many lives as possible. And as far as I've noticed, often not looking at the consequences. You can't just blame yourself for everything that happens within your team just because you are the leader. You are to blame for putting yourself in danger, but not for Mikey saving you. You didn't order him to do that. And even if you did, none of you knew what consequences it'd have. And for Shell's sake, stop being so risky with your life. You're important. Yeah. Right. I probably should have worded it differently. No, no, it's okay. I understand. Besides, being straightforward is kind of your thing. <laughs> Thanks. Pretty sure I got that after you. 
gosh, this is awkward. What the shell do I do now? What would Sensei do? You suck at comforting, you know that? I'm a soldier, not a comforter. Don't blame yourself. It won't save anybody. Trust me. Yeah, I know. Thanks, Case. You know, I gotta admit, Future Me did a good job at raising you. You're an awesome guy. <laughs> Are you crying? <laughs> Don't cry or else I'll cry too! <laughs> Maybe that's exactly what you need! <laughs>